Hey, welcome to Wild Bill's Garage. No motorcycles. That's what I do in the wintertime now. I'm becoming a luthier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I did that. Is that? There we go. That's that's why I'm not becoming a luthier. You can see my first project is this. It started on cheap guitars. Is the, the old Series A bass. I put the new keys on it. I had to do some drilling in there, and. Uh, you can see I, I can see I spaced that wrong. I got the string spacing ruler. Yeah, I'm an investor in Stumac now. I'm part of the company. Good grief, that shit is expensive. That, 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 that. I'm gonna learn to use the three corner file. That, that, and on and on and on. And today I'm gonna put new strings on Junior's little Ibanez. That's what I'm using for recording now. I've got my interface going, the new one cheap bottom of the line interface but my god dude this package all these, all these packages now come with the mic I'm using the little line six that's what the line six is good for because it's got no horsepower it's low volume it's recording all kinds of sounds and you can play it on your interface this guitar i've been up and down it it's uh, i had to release the neck again a little bit you know i'm reading the other same height from the 24th as the first fret but my bridge is way high but I can't drop the bridge because then I can't see my knife. I got some. I got somebody in a week or two here is going to give me a hand on some of these more questions that I. <clears throat> I've been around guitars 50 years, but fixing them. This one I really miss, man. This is only a four four hundred dollar, five hundred dollar Epiphone, but it's got that Gibson <laughs> crunch. But every guitar I have, I play for a minimum an hour a day, minimum sometimes two or three hours. And they, they're all wore. This one, oh, I don't even want to tell you the story of this. This one I've had for 40 years. I bought it when it was a day old. And I have, oh, let's not go there. Oh, this one's I've had for uh, 50, 55, 56 years. My, my dad made this, my stepdad, for me when I was like four or five. He had a hummingbird, 67 hummingbird. And he made me a little replica. Pretty cool. Uh, I, I'm gonna, gonna put on some big fat Gibson frets on that one and maybe a, some kind of a whammy bar. Yeah, no, not really. Anyways, that's what Wild Bill's doing in the wintertime. Hey, say hello, Bill. Over and up from Wild Bill's garage.